wanted to commemorate him, and I wanted to, I wanted to have something decent, something to report, and something holy, something meaningful, something soulful. Something to commemorate and remember our beloved brother for. So still you know, over here, the Melvin Show, so your know, beloved brother, Minister Melvin. Like y'all been doing. Seem like y'all been up. Hopefully taking care of a lot of business. I've been speaking on a lot. But my man is always on my people. You know, family, you know, good morning, family. This is your beloved brother. Minister Mill. After I am your beloved brother, minister, well, I am not your dog. Beloved brothers and sisters, we're going to be going ahead and getting deep on, off, into it. Oh, yes, we is. Yes, we is. Yes, we is. Now, we have such a rather interesting podcast today because your beloved brother has been up meditating and going through the different intervals of coming up with receiving revelations from Almighty God about us, bros, and hugs. I love y'all. I love my people. I don't care what color you is. You can be color of this shirt. Don't matter to me. Long as you don't hang black folks and believe in lynching black folks from truth. A lot of people still believe in this, you know. In fact, just a couple months ago, they just lynched a brother and propped him up in some uh, in between some monkey bars. Right by a police station. The police cameras on by the police station and by the park were disabled. Mysteriously. A black man come up home and you see how they do and they expect us to well, I need, uh, Man, I'm telling you. Boy, these some dirty hoods. Beloved brothers and sisters, all heads are bowed, all eyes are closed. Yeah. They know y'all need to know. Lord, Father God, Allah, we come humble before you with a bowed head and a humble heart. Thus praying, Father God, for the forgiveness of the sins that we have committed thus far. Thus praying, Father God, thanking you for another beautiful day of life. And thus praying, Father God, to be constantly and continuously guided along the straight path. The path of those that encourage your love, your mercy, your care, and your concern. Not the path of those that go astray, worshiping Satan and burn. The path of those that encourage your wisdom, your knowledge, and your divine overstanding. Not the path of those that go astray and lean on their own minute skill, minute understanding. We pray to be, we pray against the echoes in hell. We pray against the echoes in hell. We pray to be of those constantly and continuously guided along the straight path. The path that incurs the best of decency, with the best of most, and the ultimate best of insight. For me and my body and angels bear witness that only you can provide the best of decency, with the best of most, and the ultimate best of your insight. We fall the most bear witness that there is no God but our law. We, we know that when we call upon you in your name, whether it's three or more, you are sincerity in the mix. We for the more bear witness that there is no God but Allah who came in the person, who came in the person, who came in the person, person, who came in the person of Master W. Did I, who have it to whom praise is due to you, Father God, for coming through forever. All praises go up to the most high and Lord of the world. All the world. Say it's hot, do and the in the hot in the lamb la wa. As I do and the move her man there. As I do why ride so no who I bear witness that there is no God boy Allah. I bear witness that Muhammad is his messenger and servant. Beloved brothers and sisters, we're going to be going ahead and get deep on, off, into it. Oh, yes, we is. Yes, we is. I need 10 minutes of your time. I, now I know why they don't want y'all to read this book. Now I know why they took it out the Bible. 
and several other books of the Bible. You know, beloved brothers and sisters, it's going to be very rather interesting as we get deep on off into it. Oh, yes, it is. Whoa. And don't be scared. Don't be scared. Damn it, this is what they didn't want y'all to know. Now, keep in mind that once the devil gets your mind, the enemy gets your mind, brothers and sisters, he got you. So we want to stay grounded. You know what I mean? Now, as we continue to cover this young dog case, you know, I want you all to know and understand that young dog, this whole case, it stinks. It stinks of corruption. It stinks of distrust, disloyalty. It reeks of uh, insubordination. This whole case is, is an internal cancer. Nobody's going to be able to sleep behind what they did to our beloved brother, Rapper Young Duck. Almighty God, Allah is upset or whatever name you call him. We sick and sick and tired of y'all promoting the demonic entity of the demonic, demonic music coming into the ears that y'all want our performers and entertainers to get paid off of. Only so they can create an atmosphere to send each and every last one of their off springs to hell. We're not standing for it. Almighty God is not standing for it. Every member of the melanated family, raise up, stand up, be accounted for. You did. Everybody can't do everything, but damn it, everybody, everybody can do something. Damn it. We got to save the, our babies. Our offspring is most important. How are we going to do that? There's three things, beloved brothers and sisters, that we must do. We must reprogram our young minds, okay, on African education and African studies about our history. Not his history. No, we don't want his. We want our own. I don't want nobody to give me nothing. Open up the door and I give it myself. N number two, create a portfolio a po to promote the positive propaganda. To uh, 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 create a portfolio of love, positive propaganda to promote positive love, protect that love, and reinforce our love for one another, beloved brothers and sisters. I'm going to read it again. There's three things that we must do. We must re reprogram the mind of our and re re uh, the demand of our young, develop a new approach to African education, and create a prof portfolio of positive propaganda. And don't feed and listen to the media, the white media. They whitewash everything, all they dirt. Y'all seen how Trump had all them white people storm the Capitol? And even a couple Oreo cookies. They was up in there. I hope they got their ass whooped. Running up in there. Wanting to be white. You ain't white. You know that. Right? So quit holding your butt tight. I cream. <laughs> Salute. Now. Now. And we must promote that love. Protect that love. And reinforce that love. At all costs. You dig. You dig. We get them up with things. We don't get them up with things. Now. Here's where it goes and here, here's, here's how it stands. Artificial. Artificial. Each, you know, they create the artificial earth, which is the metaverse. Because they know that as far as the real earth is concerned, Mother Earth is not happy with them. No, not at all. She doesn't like them if she was. Because of what they're doing, they're destroying her and they're continuing to destroy, to destroy her. They're corrupting music from our prophetic poets that Almighty God, our light, is raising up to help elevate and stimulate the minds of our youth to open up the pineal gland to release the serotonin and the melatonin to uncalcify the pineal gland. They're covering it up with harmonic, demonic music and they're promoting this demonic music Paying all of our hip hop artists millions and millions of dollars 
to promote death, and this death is pouring over into the pineal gland and calcifying the pineal gland of 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 all who participate in the af in the atmospheric environment created by Satan. Damn it! So they know they ain't going nowhere but to that metaverse and hell. That's the only place they can go. Now, listen, remember, the world of nature, Earth doesn't agree with them at all. She cut, America cuts down trees, America kills her own, America committed the first case of identity theft when she did it with us. That's the first case of identity theft ever. And America, the first time she ever dropped air bombs out of airships, bombs like Hiroshima, bombs and bombed on bomb people, was on her own people. Black people. Because we ain't her people. Damn it. And, and, and all of this falls up under the false doctrines of Christianity because think about it. What were we before we got here and what were we before we came over here? We were a spiritual people. None avoid a religion. Practicing spirituality. God said, oh, oh. After he seen what they were doing with the what the, as they were doing with Christianity, Christ never said he don't know nothing about no Christianity. They made that up to conceal what was going on with the slaves. You mean to tell me all that mess is going on, didn't nobody write about it? Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. I'm not stepping on nobody's religion, but it's that very same religion that's been crossing our asses out, murdering our babies out here on these damn highways, calling our mamas and making our daughters bitches and hoes. It's that religion in this world that they are corrupted. And we are they fake. Like you put on a, on a hook and go fishing with. They used to use our little black babies as crocodile bait. Why don't y'all go Google the two black women and many others that are up there on the moon with the bone, b bones in their eyes and their eyebrows and their nose? Come, I'm going to uh, I'm gonna drop a video on that. Y'all don't believe how powerful we are? When Neil Armstrong went up there, that's why he said what he said. One small step for mankind, one great step for man. Because he knows that they are mankind. They're not the original man. They are a kind of man. And they hurry up and shut his ass up too. Oh, they let him live though. Now, let's get back to it. I need about seven more minutes. Now, now, where they're going to end up is hell. All the atrocities that they have inflicted upon the real children of Israel that are, gonna, that are depicted in the book of Genesis. And we're going to get into the book of Ge uh, Genesis 6-4 when the angels came down and had sex with the women. We're going to get off into it. Now, we must tap into our electrical food, alkaline water, exercise. We must, we must get off into our hymns, our hymns. We must get off into our chants, our prayers, tapping into Almighty God, tapping into Almighty God, praying five times a day, a day, praying five times each and every day that God awards you the fortitude to open your eyes and get up and do something meaningful, something wholesome, and something soulful, beloved brothers and sisters. Plants are awesome for us. A woman or a man that know how to take care of plants is somebody that invites the spirit of Almighty God in all of his nature and the taking care of his nature. We embody that when, when we take care of nature. If you can nurture plants, you can nurture love. And if you can nurture love, then you have everything needed to to succeed from above. I love y'all. And when we begin to talk about our blackness and the blackness of Hugh, Hugh, H-U-E, Hugh. They say blackness and Hugh. Man. Hugh, man. We the original man. Not mankind. Oh, they tried to hide that part. We know all about y'all. Now, now, now. Because flowers... You know, I hate hospitals, beloved brothers and sisters. You know, dust. When you take care of flowers and you and you have flowers around you and plants and stuff like that, 
you are promoting a godly environment. Okay, a, a, a nature of God into your atmospheric environment, thus promoting a godly environment of peace. Be careful not to create an atmosphere for Satan to exploit. Now, what type of atmosphere can we be involved in that Satan could exploit? There's a whole lot of them. And, and a lot of them have to do with the demonic rap music that's not conscious, that doesn't put no meat on your head, that doesn't help you think. So combine that with all the pills and the, and the legal dope that they got going on. Oh yeah, it's open season on us. They want us to go to hell with them. It ain't gonna happen. They have inflicted too much damn pain on the melaninated people, and Almighty God has made a, He has made up His mind that if we repent, turn away from those ways, turn to Him, pray to Him, commit to Him, commit to love, and exemplify what it is to be Christ-like. Exemplify what it is to be Mohammed-like. Exemplify. See, everybody don't like us because they come from us. So don't be upset when you see all these Immanuckers running around here that they want to cut your neck off and you're going, ain't dinner. It must be bad to be black. No, it's a beautiful thing to be black. Solomon said, my, I am black and I am beautiful. Yeah, man, it's a beautiful thing to be black. Knowing that God is black. They say, oh no, Jesus was Allah. He was no, no damn Allah. You both, they damn Bible. Man, you, if they have tricked you right in front of your face, the biggest trick the white man, the, 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 the devil ever did was convince everybody he did is this. If they have convinced you that the Bible don't say he has hair and wool, eyes of fiery coal from coming over here, like, like the brothers that look like me at them 18 Omec heads over there in Mexico, and the Me Mexicans try to act like we ain't it, it, I, it, it. We everything. Our God is black, and we look just like him. So do. So do. I wake up happy every day, and I know where I'm going. I know the way. Yeah, beloved brothers and sisters. Now, I need five more minutes. Remember, Remember, beloved, don't create an atmosphere for Satan to exploit. Stones are cosmic medicine. Stones are cosmic medicine. Stones. You know, stones? David and them? Stones? Yes, they are. Stones are cosmic medicine. Pay homage to the Creator. Become familiar with God's intelligence. Beloved brothers and sisters, let's become familiar with God's intelligence. That's why over here at the house of the God in heaven on the Melvin Show show, we're always praying to be constantly and continuously guided with the best of decency, the best of morals, and the ultimate best of insight. It's through this insight that we're going to develop this, this intelligence from Almighty God. Each stone does awesome things. Gold, copper, and everything is, is, not, is, 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 is not corrosive. I'm told that the gold water is good for us. I haven't taken any yet. I'm going to do some research and try it. Please drink plenty of alkaline water and, take, take, and, and, and exercise every single day that you can. Exercise. Go out in the sun. Get you some sunlight. Mother Nature loves us. Cause we from God. Now, some religions worship the sun. I am not a part of those religions. All right. And another thing, another thing is, is that is that it needs to be because once we internalize this alkaline water, what and all of that, what that does is. It, it decalcifies the pineal gland. It opens up and we become lucid. And, and as we dream, we're able to become lucid in our dream. And if we're able to become lucid in our dreams, we're able to control our reality. And our reality is not just us, but, but the reality for our babies. We're able to incorporate that and teach them that, download that to them. It's passed down through the mitochondrial DNA. That's why they're giving the babies all these pills, black babies. 
Now, Planned Parenthood ain't nothing but a death trap. I got to go. Okay. Now, I got to zip through this. Okay. A part of your environment, but okay, we always hear this. Don't become a part of your environment. But I'm here to tell you, beloved uh, 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 brothers and sisters, do not become a part of your environment, but make your environment become a part of you. And stand for Almighty God and ride for a real call. And think with this head. In my conclusion, we are crystals. Keep that in mind. Our brain is full of crystals. Our bodies are full of crystals and water. Okay? A great source of sun gazing, walking in the dirt is called grounding. Don't walk on a concrete bath bare barefooted. Walk in the dirt barefooted. Keep keep your vibrational levels high. Beloved brothers and sisters. That's how we do that. By grounding and meditation. And and with your beloved brother, our mental plane must stay high on God and practical values of prayer is opening up the rusty locks of the pineal gland, unreleasing serotonin, high levels of conversation can help us do this as well. I have one more that I have to touch on. Okay, we got three minutes. I got one more I got to touch on. And then we're going to get off into these books real quick. And then I know we got to go. We fire deep today. That's enough. All right. Now, our children. Now, low frequency music. Our children are not looking at the wisdom of long life. Yet, it is through this wisdom of long life that we, as parents, must work to instill inside of them. You can't memorize. You can't minimize the importance of of cultural knowledge. You cannot build a healthy child. Most certainly, he or she will not have a healthy worldview if he or she does not have anything to reflect on and go and and we don't teach them the history of of all of our greatness and what it is that we we have. What we have built in history and what we have to offer, all of us. Did y'all know a black man invented the cell phone? They don't teach you that. Okay, now we're going to get off into the book of Enoch right now. And I have two and a half minutes. And, and I close. Oh, yes, it does. Now, now, yesterday we spoke about the... About the names of all of the angels, the fallen angels that came and had sex with the women and taught them all that's and, and taught them astrology. And y'all think everything, oh, I'm a cancer, I'm a Leo, I'm a this, I'm a that. The fallen angels brought all that down here. God didn't want us to know nothing about that. Now, and all the rest took wives together and they chose one for themselves and they went into them and defiled themselves with them and taught them the charms and enchantments and root cutting and making them familiar with the plants. They got pregnant and gave birth to and to, and to great giants whose height and were 3,000 eels. When man could not sustain them anymore, the giants turned against them. Now, now, I will open up storerooms of blessings which are in the heavens, and I, and I may send them down to the earth for the work and labor of the children of men. Truth and peace are bound together for all the days of the world and all the generation of men. The Lord said to Michael, Go tell Samael and the rest of them who are afflicted with the people that they are immoral in all their uncleanliness because they had had sex with the, with mankind. They had came down and had sex. Okay, like that. With the, with the women. In those days shall they be driven out into the pit of the fire. Torment and shall be locked up in jail forever and ever. There's jail in hell. Then shall Shamael be burnt. And the others shall be cut off with him. They shall be burnt up together until the end of all time. Kill all the lusty hearts. And the watchers sons. For they have wronged mankind. Mankind is the white man. Cut off from the face of the earth. All unrighteousness and all evil work shall cease. Because the white man brings about all the wickedness and the evilness. See, when they came to Lot and tried to have sex with the angels that God sent to bring a message to mankind. They, the white man wanted to have sex with them angels. They didn't want 
no word from God. Lot offered them his wife. They said, no, nah, we want that black, them angels. And they black angels with dreads, we want that booty. That black booty. That man booty. Them was angels. They ain't for y'all. Suckers. Now, there's more to go off into that. But in my closing, we're going to go into the, uh, the, uh, the book of African Proverbs. If you see a friend without a smile, give him one of yours. I'm going to say it again. If you see a friend without a smile, give him one of yours. If you want to go quickly, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. I need y'all. The Holy Quran. Now when Moses had fulfilled the term and was traveling with his family, he perceived a fight in the direction of the Mount Tera. He said to his family, Terry here, I perceive a fire. I hope to bring you some, bring you from there some information or a burning firebrand that you may warm yourself. Warm in the heart. See, it was so much, he was talking about what was going on down there with them other group of people down there. And what they were participating in was probably the booty and the duty. And matter of fact, that's exactly what it was. In my conclusion, Kafa actually broke the tradition in the fourth dynasty by the Negro features of the feet. Did not change the classical style painting in a tomb at the best, the oldest city of the blacks. See, we have always been a awesome people and God loves us. But the biggest changes in the racial character of Egypt always occurred during the crisis period of political decentralization. And these are things that they have always been accustomed to and getting us away from God. This, 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 the general Except the view, I know that elsewhere that it was not a mass explosion of Asians. One history of one lesson of history is quite clear. One's own leaders may be as unjust, inhumane, and as brutal as strangers. All my skin folk, skin folk ain't my kin folk. Beloved brothers and sisters, whenever I come before you, I come before you in all peace and all harmony. For the upliftment and the advancement of my people. I love each and every last one of you. I greet each and every last one of you with the greeting words of peace. We say it in the Arabic language. Assalamu alaikum.